Alright guys, welcome to another video. Today we're going to be taking a look at another belt. Another belt from Slide Belts. So stay tuned to the intro. What's up? My name is Doug, the Bearded Outdoorsman. Welcome to another video. If you enjoy beard product reviews, gear reviews, and gear tips, then you have come to the right place. Take that first step click that subscribe button. Okay, so today we've done reviews on belt from slide belt before, uh, but this one is pretty unique. This one we're gonna talk about is the survival belt. All right, so that's what we're gonna talk about today. This is a survival belt. It comes with the belt and with the buckle, and the buckle is pretty unique in what it does. So this is another ratchet belt. So you can see here, if I can get it all twisted around right, you have these back here unlike the other belts this one is has ratchet all the way down all right so this is another one that you cut to fit cut to your size and you can make sure it fits you so i would take this off out here to show you but this one i'm pretty sure has deeper teeth than the other one does and it is very difficult to undo this which is really good i like that it's not going to loosen up on you and fall out so what does the survival belt from slide belts have that the other belts don't well it has a lot of features so let's just get this thing situated where we can show you so first off it's just a, a metal belt buckle it's got a little weight to it but it just looks clean it doesn't look like this is a survival anything by just looking at it when it's on your pants so the first thing that you have you have to pull the buckle like you would be releasing the belt you have to pull the buckle and you have a knife blade all right so a safety feature that slide belts has introduced in this is you have to pull the buckle to get the knife out otherwise it will not come out all the way it is a liner lock you have a lock right here that you push to release the blade to close it and it's a pretty sharp little blade now i don't have exact measurements on this as how long this blade is but i would venture to say it is anywhere from maybe one and a half inches pretty close to one and a half inches it also has a bottle opener right here you can actually access the bottle opener without accessing the knife keep the buckle closed and you can pull the knife blade up that high and you can see it i'm looking at you you can see it right there you've got the bottle opener because what edc tool is complete without a bottle opener we need them we need them on everything right so the next big feature this has it's right here tucked in on the bottom so if you put it on this way it'd be on the bottom side and i can tell you this gets a little snug there's some o-rings on there which help keep it snug but you pull that out and you have an led flashlight which is bright enough to get the job done in a survival situation but you just screw this bevel, bezel. You screw that and it turns on. You unscrew it, it turns off. On the other end of that, you have a ferro rod. So you can use your knife blade to scrape it, to throw sparks, and it does a great job. Now I can tell you something about slide belts. You can pick up, if you lose this, or if you wear this ferro rod down, you can go to slide belts and you can pick up a replacement LED flashlight ferro rod for about 10 bucks so not too not too bad now i can tell you just in me using this and wearing this belt there were a couple times it was a challenge to get this out only because i had slid it in there so far but i was able to get it out but the deeper you slide that in there the harder it is to get out but it slides right in on the bottom you can see the flashlight there if you pull this out you've got just a little hole there and that holds in there just like that and it's not going anywhere so overall a great belt you this keeps you from having to carry extra stuff in your pockets or extra stuff in your pack if you don't know what the situation is going to entail you're ready you have a knife blade you have a flashlight you have a ferro rod and you have a bottle opener <laughs> never know so you have means to start fire and whatever else you may need to do just with your buckle all right so let's talk price price includes the belt and the buckle 
it's on slide belt website for 150 dollars now you're gonna say hey that's expensive for a belt but for what this packs in a punch it packs a lot of stuff a lot of gear in one package that you probably wear a belt every single day and to have these kind of things readily available is 150 dollars too much that's for you to decide but i will have a link in the description below i am an affiliate for slide belts um, that does not sway my opinion on this i think it's an amazing product i think what they've been able to do and how they've put these products in this package is pretty amazing so i've seen buckles before that have knife blades in them but you've got to undo your belt you've got to do all this stuff just to get to the blade but what slide belts has done here is pretty awesome so i'll have links in the description below you get over and check that out it is the survival belt from slide belts all right guys well that is it for today i hope you found this video helpful i hope you learned something today learn about a new product if you're interested in this like i said there'll be links in the description if you've used this product before drop it in the comments i'd love to hear your take on it pros cons whatever i have zero cons about this it is just an amazing belt an amazing belt buckle i've worn this with my ccw and had zero problems i've worn this just on a daily basis nobody knows that there is a knife blade in there so it's pretty perfect in my opinion so Check it out. If you got any questions, let me know. And until next time, guys, stay bearded, get outdoors, and God bless.